for the longest time I did not bother building a Castle Forgotten Heroes team. The dungeon came out, I was like, Ancient Swift Runes, those are going to eat up a whole lot of reaps. Let me just continue farming for Rage, for Ancient Rage, Ancient uh, Despair, Ancient Will. So finally, like a week and a half ago, I decided to build a Castle Forgotten Heroes team. Very reliable, free to play friendly as far as units. Free to play friendly also in terms of runes, but you guys, some of you are going to disagree. They're going to be like, oh, I'll never get those runes. Oh my god, 120 speed. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I have been playing for eight years, I never got those runes. So basically, it's just a bunch of bruisers, multiple sources. Multiple sources of defense break. You get brownie points in the comments if you can uh, figure out which all of these uh, <laughs> all of these uh, motor noises are coming from. So, I don't remember what I was saying. Multiple sources of defense break, multiple sources of cleanse and immunity. The boss keeps changing elements based on whoever does the most damage to him. He also takes kind of skills that are similar to the units that he has on the left and the right, but that's kind of a thing in a lot of these dungeons anyway. Um, so right now he's going to do damage based on speed, and he's also going to defense break the opponents, kind of like the twins that are on the sides of him. Uh, for the first uh, part of his little phase, also he does damage that, um, damage that ignores effects that resist death, so like Theomars and Triana and things like that. You can still revive, um... But it does things, uh, damage that, uh, ignores things that resist death. And then also, it ignores the shields and things like that as well. Uh, in this one, he is decreasing enemies' attack. He's kind of taking, like, a hybrid Leo, uh, skill here. For the first round, he takes, uh, he does attack power buff, he does defense buff, and he does crit resist. So... We're going to also see, so like I said, this is a very reliable team. We're going to take a look at the runes. I think that we are on the 10th run. Yes, we are on the 10th run. I mean, we get nothing, so it doesn't really matter if you farm it anyway. The noise outside my window is constantly ridiculous. Okay, so uh, like I said, it is very reliable. However, sometimes units die. It is not super fast. We got like two minute run times. Uh, we saw one of the, okay, so werewolf died here. And then we had two units die here, but the run still completed just fine. I think I've seen it lose once ever in the time that I've been running this, which is like a week and a half. Just casually, not like farming all day, every day, obviously, because it's Dimension Hole. Uh, let's take a look at the runes, and let's see what they've got on them. So we've got just Nemesis and Determination, Speed, HP, HP. Yes, I use. I have a couple Veramoss, but I use this guy for, for more than just this. I actually use him in Guild Wars. He does just fine on this. It's crazy to see him not on Valentine. He really doesn't need to be, uh, he really doesn't need to be on Valentine. I have no idea what the artifacts on him are. Who even knows? We have, oh, this is kind of slow. Uh, she's supposed to be faster, but yeah, these are the runes on, I must have taken them. Oh yeah, I must have taken them off to put them on something else. So I have to redo this, but you can see this works with it. She's, she's pretty tanky. She could use more defense. She definitely needs more speed. She's got good resistance here. Uh, but she is on already showed the runes. Yeah, those are her artifacts. It's really nothing special This is Kaki again. This is not a super premium Kaki. He's kind of slow for a Kaki He kind of does not have enough stats for a Kaki, for a general Kaki, but he does the job People got people gonna comment. They're going oh, that's a god Kaki. It is not a god Kaki Nope, uh, so that's the stats on him. These are the stats on the were the werewolf's kind of fast. I'll give you that. The werewolf's kind of fast. He doesn't need to be. You actually don't even need to use the werewolf. Uh, some people use different things. Some people use. I know Darren is very popular in here as well. Doesn't necessarily need to be the werewolf. This is just how fast I have him, which is kind of fast. You can go a little bit slower. Um, and then, I think Darren actually works pretty good. Let's let's test out some different teams and let's see what else works.